board of being terrorized. And they just said, no, there's no way you're coming out after day two, or five, or eight, or 12, 14, 20, right? The first ones to go will look reckless and crazy, but then others will follow. have tried to think ahead, um, you know, and each of our states has had to make decisions on our own. We need to move with all due haste uh, to impose these kinds of restrictions and do the things that we need to do to keep people isolated. People need to stay in their homes if they can. If you have essential duties that you need to go out for, you should absolutely go do those. And starting May 1st, you must wear a mask when you're out in public, the face covering is required if you cannot maintain a six foot distance outside. Inside, they're required, so you must wear one while grocery shopping. And many people have asked, why can't we go to state parks? We can safe, safely socially distance there. Despite the steps being taken toward reopening the economy, Governor J.B. Pritzker says now is not the time to let up and open up fully. He says we must finish the job of fighting COVID-19. To everyone listening, we are in possibly the most difficult part of this journey. I know how badly we all want our normal lives back. Believe me, if I could make that happen right now, I would. But this is the part where we have to dig in and we have to understand that the sacrifices that we've made as a state to avoid a worst case scenario are working. And we need to keep going a little while longer to finish the job. Where's the first lady? Is she accompanied by a state security detail? Has she engaged in non-essential travel? What is your response to people who say the stay-at-home order and non-essential travel bans aren't being abided by your family? I believe there's a report from Illinois Rising Action that says that she recently traveled to Florida. Well, first of all, I want to say that in politics, it used to be that we kept our families out of it. You know, my official duties have nothing to do with my family. So I'm just not going to answer that question. It's inappropriate, and I find it reprehensible, honestly, that that, uh, that reporter wrote a story about it. Governor Pritzker insists the state must stay the course and follow the guidelines. People need to stay in their homes. Where's the first lady? You know, my official duties have nothing to do with my family. To stay in their home. Governor Pritzker draws a line in the sand about cities and counties that are looking to reopen. Downstate Madison County is moving ahead to reopen, but the governor promises consequences. Governor Pritzker insists the state must stay the course and follow the guidelines. There is a growing chorus who disagree, saying they're frustrated by these restrictions. There are calls to open up the parts of the state where coronavirus is not as serious. Businesses and individual professionals that are licensed by state agencies will be held accountable for breaching public health orders. Counties that try to reopen in defiance may not be reimbursed by FEMA for damages they cause because they ignored the law. The governor's plan was not well thought out. It's just impossible for people in the suburbs or in the collars to be able to have to live by the Chicago standards. Yeah, my official duties have nothing to do with my family. Well, I'm just not going to answer that question. Do the things that we need to do to keep people isolated. As part of these latest guidelines, animal grooming services will also be able to reopen. Hairstylists, barber shops still allowed to not reopen. You know, the last thing that Mayor Lightfoot wanted to talk about today was getting a haircut. She's begged, lashed out, and used humor to try and get people to stay at home to stop the spread of COVID-19. But a photo that surfaced on social media showing the mayor after getting a trim has some asking, what about me? The mayor was asked at least twice about the haircut this afternoon. I'm out in the public eye, and, you know, I'm a... I'm, I'm a person who I take my personal hygiene very seriously. As I said, I felt like I needed to um, have a haircut. I'm not able to do that myself, and so I got a haircut.
Lake Mayor also says warm weather is no excuse to congregate in parks or on streets. She also plans on enforcing social distancing at stores that remain open while the stay-at-home order is in effect. We are sending inspectors out. We will demand that you do this, and if you do not, we will shut you down. Now, the governor at his afternoon daily press conference was asked about the haircut that Mayor Lightfoot got over the weekend. He really didn't allow himself to go down that road other than to say that we're all making sacrifices at this time and that so far he has not gotten a haircut since his day at home order went into effect. Fishing and boating will be allowed, but only in groups of no more than two, and you'll be able to golf. The state will set guidelines for courses to keep people safe.